photographers. In this video, you're going to see me wrapping a newborn in what I call the twist wrap. You start with the baby in the center of the wrap, then bring the ends together and you're going to twist in the front. Then tuck the fabric back underneath the baby. Now, I like this wrap technique because it's prettier than your basic swaddle and allows for baby's hands and feet to be out, so it's great for variety and posing. But, because baby's hands and feet are free, this wrap works best with an already sleepy baby. Now, if you have extra fabric, you can either leave it all behind the baby or bring some down around baby's tush to help tuck the legs up a little more. Technique two, over the shoulder. Now for this one, you need a wrap that's long enough to cover baby from shoulders to knees. Place the baby in the first one third of the wrap. Begin by tucking baby's legs up onto her belly, then bringing the fabric across her belly and legs, making sure to stay under her arm. Tuck the end of the fabric underneath. Next, bring the long side of the fabric across her belly and legs. Now, instead of going underneath that arm, you're gonna go over the shoulder. Bring the fabric around her back and then over the other shoulder and tuck underneath again. Baby's arms should be free to bend at the elbows. Next, you're gonna spread the remaining fabric and bring it across both arms. This wrap is great for very wiggly babies and babies that are semi-awake or alert because it really secures the arms in place, but it also places them in the perfect position right under the chin where they look super cute. Now, if you want more newborn photography tips and tricks, check out the link in the description and you can get my free PDF that goes into detail on the 11 things that successful newborn photographers must know. Thanks for watching. If this video was helpful, please give it a like. And if you have any feedback, go ahead and leave a comment. I'd love to hear from you.